West Ham face questions of conflict of interest over women's Super League shirt sponsor. West Ham have left themselves open to accusations of a conflict of interest after allowing a leading sports management agency to become the shirt sponsor of their women's Super League team. Unique sports management appear to have five members of Manuel Pellegrini's first team squad as clients and, according to information published by the FA last year, were involved in five transactions with the club between February 1, 2017, and January 31, 2018. A further player represented by the agency was signed by the club last summer. The partnership with the women's team has raised fears among agents of other players at the club over what they consider to be the growing influence of USM boss Will Salthouse. A regular in the director's box at the London Stadium, Salthouse has a strong relationship with co-chairman David Sullivan as well as his sons, David Jr. and Jack. The self-styled youngest boss in British women's football and a central figure in a BBC documentary series following the West Ham women's team, Jack, 18, is the managing director and appears to be behind the decision to have USM as a second sponsor on the shirts of a team lying sixth in the women's Super League. Two agents admitted to Sports Mail that the deal makes them nervous. One of the agents claimed it was a conflict of interest, adding, It just feels a bit too cozy. In November, Sports Mail revealed Salthouse received payments totaling £10,000 from a bookmaker, in the form of free bets, after introducing them to his players at Cheltenham Racecourse. The Sporting Chance Clinic, which was set up to support players with problems such as gambling addictions, described the agent's willingness to receive financial reward from a bookie as appalling. They said it raised concerns about a poor attitude to player care. Salthouse indicated through his lawyers that everyone who attended Cheltenham was aware of the payments. West Ham's main shirt sponsor is the gambling platform Bitway. West Ham declined to comment last night and would not reveal how much the deal is worth. A request to USM to reveal how much they are paying to have their logo on the women's shirts also met with no response. USM are one of the three sponsors secured for the women's team. The club stressed they dealt with a variety of agents during their transfer dealings last summer.